The flow of language. Understanding, float downstream. Hello, language enthusiasts. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of idiomatic expressions. Specifically, we'll explore what it means to float downstream in English. This picturesque phrase isn't just about rivers and boats. It's a rich part of the language that offers deep insights into culture and context. So, let's set sail and decode this expression together. At its most basic, float downstream directly refers to the action of an object or person moving along the current of a river or stream without effort. Imagine a leaf gently gliding on the water's surface, effortlessly carried by the flow. This visual helps us grasp the literal sense of the phrase, setting the stage for deeper understanding. Transitioning from the literal, let's explore how float downstream is used figuratively in everyday language. As an idiom, it describes a situation where someone goes along with the prevailing trend or path of least resistance, often without much effort or direct personal input. It's about allowing the metaphorical current of circumstances to guide one's course, rather than swimming against it. Example in context. Imagine a conversation at the workplace about adopting a new system. If one employee says, I guess we'll just have to float downstream and see how this new system works out, they're implying a willingness to go along with the change passively, letting the situation unfold naturally without resistance. While float downstream can have a neutral or even positive connotation, suggesting adaptability and ease, it's important to note the context. Sometimes, it might imply a lack of initiative or avoidance of making active decisions. Understanding these subtleties is crucial for non-native speakers to use the phrase appropriately in conversations. Positive connotation, going with the flow during a group decision, showing adaptability. Negative connotation, avoiding responsibility or not contributing ideas in a team project, indicating passivity. And there we have it, fellow language explorers. Today, we navigated the currents of the English language and uncovered the rich meanings behind float downstream. From its literal interpretation to its figurative nuances, this phrase offers a glimpse into the flexibility and depth of English idioms. We hope this journey has been illuminating and that you're now more confident in using and understanding this expressive part of the English language. Until our next linguistic voyage, keep exploring and enjoying the flow of language.